Hello everyone and welcome back to Bitcoin Tips. So today we're going to be talking about how you can start mining Shiba Inu coin using your Windows 10 or 11 base computer here in 2024 in less than 10 minutes. So if all of that sounds interesting to you, I do want to make sure to ask you to stick around through the entire video so that you don't miss out on any of the great tips and tricks that I have to help you build up more Shiba Inu holdings faster in 2024. So, before we dive into the video today, I always like to start off here on CoinMarketCap, just taking a look at what's going on in the market in case you're watching this video in the future, just as a point of reference. So if you aren't interested in this portion of the video, feel free to skip ahead one to two minutes, but I think this is going to be a particularly interesting analysis. So overall, as you can see here, crypto is still on a really strong upward movement. Overall, total market cap is $2.98 trillion, which is up 8.24% over the last 24 hours. Of course, leading the charge is Bitcoin, almost $90,000, $89,102 at the moment. That's up 10.41% today and 31.5% this week. So that is awesome to see. Many people believe that this is the start of the 2024-2025 bull run, obviously kicked off by the Bitcoin halving earlier this year in April, May timeframe. As you can see, Bitcoin is not the only one going up. Uh, Ethereum is still climbing great, up almost 40% this week. Solana, same story, almost 40% this week. Binance, 18.8% this week. Dogecoin, 121% this week. 36 cents on Dogecoin. Now, of course, skipping just a few here, not that they're not important, but overall, lots of green. But taking a look here at the star of today's episode, Shiba Inu. This is a popular meme coin that came around in the last bull run around 2020. Now, this coin made a lot of people very rich last time around, and it is still placed currently at number 10 here on CoinMarketCap, of course, based on market capitalization. With that being said, it is up 58% this week to four zeros and then a 2717. So a lot of people are predicting that this could, again, repeat and make a lot of money similar to Dogecoin, similar to Bitcoin, Ethereum, all these other cryptos. So how do you start mining this coin and building up some holdings so that if it does get back to just where it was before in the last bull run, around the four zeros and an eight, um, you have a potential of four zeros and a six worth of earnings. So that is a lot of doubling, that's tripling, and you know, looking at a lot of additional income. So how do you start mining this coin? Well, what we're looking at here is a site called Unminable. Now, if you're not familiar with Unminable, basically what this site allows you to do is mine coins that aren't traditionally mineable using an algorithm that is most profitable for your specific hardware. So you're not actually mining Shiba Inu straight up. You're actually going to be mining a different coin and then getting paid out in Shiba, which is really cool. Now, if you're not familiar with what is the best algorithm to use for your hardware, what I would recommend is going over to a site called whattomine.com, enter in your hardware, usually it's just one or two GPUs depending on your setup, and it'll say, hey, you know, the best algorithm for you is fish hash. Um, I'm just making that up. I don't know if it is or isn't. Um, I usually do these tutorials based off uh, the Kapow algorithm, which basically what that is is it's mining Ravencoin. So, once you figure that out, what you're going to do is come back to Unminable, and if I forgot to mention, there's a link in the description below, which if you use that link, it'll actually save you 25% on your pool mining fees, which I'll talk about in just a minute. So what you're going to do, click that link, come over here and select Get Started with our Wizard. There's two options, Basic and Advanced. I always recommend going with Basic, since that's good enough for 99% of people watching, but that Advanced option is there as well. I'm going to be following the GPU path, but if you are following along and want to mine with your Windows-based CPU or you want to mine on a Mac-based computer, follow the CPU path here. Again, I'm going to go with Kapow. This is probably going to be one of the more profitable algorithms for most people watching, but as always, things in crypto are always changing, so I do always recommend checking whattomine.com. 
Of course, we're going to choose Shiba Inu, but feel free to choose whatever else you're interested in if you're following this tutorial. Um, and then the final step here before kind of getting into the mining is entering in your address. Now, I do like to say, please double and triple check this address. You can see that it does come up and say, hey, this looks like it's compatible. But if I delete this little E at the end, you can see it does show that it is now red. Um, but if I replace it, you know, with, you know, like a D here, that still shows that it is correct. And we all know that it is not. So do keep that in mind. And the final step here is the referral code. Now, if you click to the link in the description below, you'll notice that my Bitcoin tips referral code auto populated like it did here on screen. Now, if you didn't click the link and still want to use it, it is Bitcoin dash tips, capital B, capital T. What this will get you is actually a 25% discount on your pool mining fee. So basically here on Unminable, there's a 1% fee for whatever you're mining. Um, it always is going to take one coin for every hundred that you mine um, as the fee. So using this code, what it does is it reduces it down to 0.75%, meaning that for every hundred coins, instead of giving one of those coins, you're going to give 0.75. So it will help you build up your holdings faster. So feel free to use this code. If not, you can continue without it. That's completely fine, but you will pay that higher fee. So go ahead and select next and you're at the final step where you download the miner and get started. So as you can see here, there's a number of different options. I personally always recommend Gminer as it's compatible with both major GPU manufacturers and it's the one that I personally use and have had a lot of luck with. Not to say that any of these other ones are bad, I've used just about every one of them, but Gminer is my personal favorite. So what you can do is go ahead and select download minor files. This will take you to the GitHub where you just select this Windows 64 zip file, download this to your computer and extract it. Please make sure you don't miss the extraction step. If you do skip that, it will not start. So if you run into issues right away, make sure that you did the extraction step. Then what you're going to do is come back to unminable here and select download.bat file. You'll notice here that Google Chrome has called this out and said, hey, this is an unverified file. Are you sure you want to download this? You will have to go ahead and say, yes, continue download unverified file if you want to continue mining. Now, if this is something you're not comfortable with, that's completely fine. Simply select delete from history. Unfortunately, mining is not going to be the best path for you since this is a problem with just about every mining program out there. Um, it's just part of mining. So if you're not comfortable with it, please select delete. But if you are comfortable with that, go ahead and select download. Then what you're going to do is find the file with uh, you know all the f um, different files that you just download and extracted. You're going to take this file, drag and drop it into that same folder. I just had to move it off screen to do that real quick. But as you can see, I now have my unminable shib kapow gminer.bat file. At this point, all you have to do is double click this to get started. Now you will notice that Windows Defender pops up and says, hey, we've prevented this unrecognized app from running. It may be a risk. You will have to say more info and run anyway. Again, if you're not comfortable doing this, simply just say don't run, delete the files from your computer and move on to something else in crypto. Unfortunately, again, this is you'll see this just the first time you run this file, but it's a part of every mining program. So if you are comfortable with it, go ahead and say run anyway. And just like that, you can see my RTX 3070 on Windows 11 is now mining Shiba Inu through the unminable pool in less than 10 minutes. We are coming up on nine minutes here on the recording clock. And of course that included about three minutes worth of intro looking at coin market cap and celebrating those higher crypto prices. So it is really that simple, probably less than five minutes, you could be up and running. Now, just a few final things that I like to mention about Unminable here. Now that we've got this up and running, there's no red text, there's no errors, this will start to mine and it will start to accumulate here under the addresses tab um, when you paste in the same address that you used to start. It does take 15 to 30 minutes for that data to start showing up, so don't worry if it's not immediately there. But if it doesn't show up after the first, you know, maybe half hour to an hour, something may be configured incorrectly or you may have pasted your address in incorrectly, so I would definitely start there. And on the other side, when you are ready to be done mining, all you have to do is find this CMD window and select the red X. 
Once that CMD window is fully closed out, you are no longer mining. Now you may be thinking, why am I telling you how to close a window? It's not that hard. Well, here on Unminable, when you stop the miner, for whatever reason, you may continue to see stats and possibly even payments to your on-site balance for up to 12 hours after stopping that miner. I've personally seen payments come in many hours after stopping it. I don't really know why it happens, but I have seen the question before of, hey, you know, I've closed this window, but I'm still getting paid. Is it mining in the background? You can make sure as long as that's closed, you are no longer mining. So you can use your computer for gaming, video editing, some work, whatever you need to do, or simply just shut it down. So with that being said, that is how to get started mining Shiba Inu in less than 10 minutes here in 2024. If you run into any issues throughout the whole process, please feel free to leave a comment down below. I'm always happy to help troubleshoot and get you up and running um, to help you build your Shiba Inu holdings. So if you liked this video, please consider hitting the like button and subscribe to Bitcoin Tips to stay up to date on all things crypto. Thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed and I hope to see you in my next video. Bye.